Good morning, Sunday, 18th of September 2016. The fourth and final round of the Dave Berkshire Motorcycles Two Man Enduro Championship. That's three titles uh, in this uh, contest. One has already been won by Michael Ridge and Ross Taylor. That's the expert class, they can't be overtaken because there's only four rounds this year and all rounds will count. So we have the championship up for grabs between two teams and the club and up for grabs. There's about six teams could win it if the results go the right way for the, the lowest of the teams. This is Ty Farm Great Cornard. Yes, the legendary course. Under new ownership. It was last year when we used it in April for the day Roper. But hopefully, we can only use it in September. Now that uh, we can use it next year as well. But it will not be for two men. Are we all here? Yes. Yes. I've seen him. Somewhere. So I give him these two um, papers. Uh, it's Tim Walsh here. He needs to register his transponder. I've seen him. Right, OK, uh, let's start then. Welcome, everybody, to uh, Great Cornard. Subby Motorcycle Two Man. This is the fourth and final round of the Two Man Championship. All points count for today and all the other rounds. Um, we'll start off with the timing. We've got the Subby Club uh, transponder system, which you're probably all familiar with. But for those of you who are not, look behind you. You see the uh, receivers. They work both sides now, so there's effectively four channels there you can go down. Um, the wrist transponder just has to be within a foot of that receiver. The old ones you actually had to touch it, so just get it within the, the rough area of the, trans, the, the receiver and look at the uh, screen in the black box for your number to come up. If your number doesn't come up, it hasn't received your, your number, so you have to wait and it's down to you to uh, make sure your number comes up. So obviously at the end of the day, if you're missing laps, that's only yourself to blame. Yeah, yeah. Okay? <laughs> right, the yellow flags as well, that is at the point where you clock in. So when you're waiting, if you come early, you need to stay out of the way. We've put a lane on the side where you can wait. Please do not wait at the entrance when other people want to go through on their time, yeah? Because some people will be going, on, going through on their time and want to go through you know, relatively quickly. So we've got to keep the entrance to the gates totally clear. So just wait to the edge. Um, the lap is roughly three, three and a half minutes long. So we're doing a third of a lap penalty per minute, late or early. So um, that's the penalties done. The lap is fast. Uh, it's pretty similar to how we normally run over here. But there's a lot of gating. So in other words, you'll come out of a corner and then you'll look like the tape's disappeared. But if you sort of look at the brow of the hill, you'll find some gates. So try and keep to the gates, because that's obviously where the course goes. Um, I think that's it on the course, really. I mean, it's going to be much better than it normally is. It's normally pretty slippery, but I don't think it will be today. Um, Just for those that walked down around earlier, I've tightened that. First yeah, we've, that for those of you who walked the track earlier, we've put a, a big loop in just on this field here, just to try and lengthen it a bit, and we've tightened up the uh, the bit through the hedge over there. Just that gateway over there, so as you're not actually turning when you go through the gateway, because we've got to respect the land for the farmer, otherwise we might lose it, like you know, because we've actually been given this land today for nothing. Uh, yeah, so obviously hopefully it, if we can, you know, keep him happy, we'll get it future events. Um, and please take all your litter home with you because we mustn't leave anything on the field. Um, yeah, there's one other thing. You've got um, time cards. The reason for the time cards purely is so you have your times on there so you know when you're coming through. They're not going to be written on, but you pass them to your partner, yeah? So that's the only reason that you've got them. 
Uh, everything else is done by the, the computer. Yes. Yeah, that's it, yeah. Uh, any questions? No? All right, have a great day. First one's away, 10 o'clock has just come up. Spray Roper. Number one is Raven. Number two, Rob Nickel. Number one, Ben Walsh. Four, five, and six on the next one. Three, four, you can go. Five, six, seven, and eight are next. They're very lethargic coming up here today. Right. That'll be off soon. Dad says no. No, if Dad says no, take your pocket money, John. <laughs> Put the zoom in. Panoramic here at Type Arm. 
watch this film and just see everything. It's lovely for spectators. It's an intro to watching today. It's the same rope coming up there. Number 34. Oh, there's a lot of here now. Look at them. Those two are having a little battle. Hopefully I'll get the beach. Of all these drivers coming down here. And there's more. Yeah. 